Charlton Left Disability Counts is um, a football club for disabled youngsters and adults. We range from age eight to as old as you want to go and able to play football. It's all about the ability to play, not the, the techniques that you can provide. It's just enjoying and having fun. It's important for these boys to be out playing football because otherwise some of them don't get the chance to. You know, there's not a lot of clubs that take dis disabled kids on. You know, unfortunately, mainstream players, you know, some of the, most of the players that come here can't make it mainstream. So that's why they come to us to play football and play games because mainstream teams, some of the levels are too high for them so they can't get involved or they just, they're just not welcome, unfortunately. So here we welcome, obviously, all disabilities and they come in with players that have got either the same disability, different disabilities, so they learn about different disabilities and what other players have got and they learn off each other and that's how they grow as a team. Joe's been coming to Charlton for the last couple of years. Um, he's always loved football, always wanted to play football, but never really had an opportunity to do it because of his disability. Um, so when we first found out he was going to be coming here, he was so excited and when he, when he got home from after coming, he sat on the bottom steps, he took his boots off, took his shin bags off and said to me, Mum, Mum, there are kids there and they're just like me. And it made me feel that he's actually started to belong to a team, to a group of people that were just like him, that just wanted to play football, wanted to enjoy football, without any matter of what disability they've got. And they've got all sorts of disabilities here. Joe's got cerebral palsy, there's all sorts here. There's uh, kids with Asperger's, kids that are deaf. Um, so they've all just joined in and they all realise that they're a little bit different, but the one thing they've got in common is football. I come to Charlton at Billy FC because it's just to come in, get some fitness, get to play some football, especially when it comes to the tournaments. It's just about playing football. It's just all about football, it's just football. My son's been coming to Charlton Ability Accounts FC for nine years. It's been absolutely amazing for Brian. He started three years ago when he was nine. My son, Sonny, has been coming to Charlton for at least two years now. He comes here because he's got a disability and it helps him progress as a footballer. I brought him here and it, it was just the best decision I ever made. He absolutely loves it. It's brilliant for his social skills. His mobility has improved, his football skills have improved and actually that has had a knock-on effect in mainstream because it's now helping him to blend in with children at school more and he's got so much more confidence, he feels part of a team and you know feels like he's got a necessary part in society. Since coming here his, his actual football skills have really, really improved, his social skills have tremendously improved, he's a very happy child. It's just absolutely brilliant for all types of children. What I get out of Charlton Disability Athletic Club, I get like skills where I can like play in the matches and like my shooting improves like every time I come to this training <coughs> session on Thursdays and like <laughs> it's a great thing to do, it's a great social event as maybe you, for kids who can't do it so often. It's a great thing to come to, it's a lot of fun and you get to play a tournament every month so it's a really great thing to come to. <laughs> the coaching like, is positive and they're like trying to help you all the time, like non-stop like, helping you, so it's good. So when we come here, like, like all, all, all boys are very like... They're very um, talkative. Yeah, talkative okay. yeah, like, and um, friendly. Yeah, I played like loads of friends, like which were like we uh, go on uh, Xbox a lot. Oh my! <laughs> 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 oh my. <laughs> we go on Xbox a lot. <laughs> Thursday nights is a training night. Um, we get all the boys together. We have the juniors in earlier. And the idea is to teach them new techniques, um, make them feel part of the team, because obviously some have social skills, um, is their, their weakness. For the adult teams, we split them into two different abilities, the lower ability and the higher ability. We usually work on possession-based drills or technical work, such as attack v defense, 
or set pieces at the tournament. We can watch the boys, see what they do, and we can come back to training and work on the things that we didn't do well. And also, we can also work on the things that we did do well. Training is a bit of a mixture of between fitness, shooting, passing and dribbling. We do stuff where we go in and out through the cones. We might do like just one, one v, like one v two or two v three. We'll do one like one two passes and then we'll try and have a shot. It's wicked to, to get running round. Um, like your first touch of, of a training session is normally dodgy, even if you're good. Um, but it takes time and then by the game time, you've got in the rhythm because it's, it's not just about how you play football, it's about getting your body in the right way. Today we've had a uh, mass excitement of getting here um, before. On Thursday they were all excited, leaving training, see you for Sunday, see you Sunday. The tournament's very important um, for them as well as for us to, to get them used to playing as a team. When they come here they get to play with and against players of their own ability and their own age which is much better and they get much more excited about it. Playing up a, a different team is, uh, yeah, just really excited. Well, morning of match day, Frankie's normally the first one up. I haven't even risen from bed and he's had a shower and he's waking me, he's raring to go, you know, to come down and try and see how his team's going to do for the day. The excitement in the morning, getting up with the uh, butterfly, so Joe experienced it, it's getting ready and uh, obviously meeting the, uh, his friends when he plays, but it's, uh, you know, it's about, you know, playing part of a team as well. He wants to play football, but it's part of meeting his friends as well. I, I, I feel pretty nervous at the beginning be, because I don't know what could happen during the match. Thinking you'll lose all the games. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah but like I, that's like the worst like, thing. Once you've like, uh, carved up pitch, even if you've lost, like, uh, you, uh, you know you've, you've played well. Anyone can come along and join the Charlton Athletic Ability Accounts, um, boys and girls. Um, we start from the age of eight and we go up to the age of 35. So anyone is welcome to come and try out. If they just want to train, that is fine. If they want to be part of a team and play in the league, then we're more than happy for them to do that. I'd say to come join because this is the perfect place to get your ability up, just to test yourself, test yourself against the other players. Come down, it's definitely for you. Don't, don't, don't be nervous, all the lads are great. It's my second season, it was my first last year. Everyone accepted me like that, yeah? Just come down, enjoy, and Charlton will be the place for you. But they've all got their, like I said, individual disabilities, and for some of them, it's the mixing, feeling part of a team, feeling part of a club, um, feeling wanted and not being the one that's sat on the bench. So it's given them friendship as well as the ability to play and keeping up their physical strength. Here, it's just absolutely fantastic. They do so much for the children, it's unreal. Honestly, Cholton is amazing. It's just amazing. I couldn't recommend it more highly. Just come here, just come to Cholton. Don't go anywhere else. I think it's just that come along and see us, see what it's actually all about.